Greetings, Dan Daniels here. Have you ever been faced with uh, a bit of code that you want to grab from a screen? <clears throat> well, Google Lens makes that a whole lot easier to extract just the information you want. I want this bit of data up here. So I'm going to click on the Google Lens, select anything to search, and I will I'm going to go ahead and grab this whole thing just to be safe. And it, it's a little fussy about how much data it grabs, but I'm not going to worry about it too much because now I'm going to copy it and I'm going to drop it into my text editor. You can see I've already done that. I'll go ahead and do it again. And you can see that I can now uh, I can now begin to extract exactly what I need, which is this part. Don't need that. Don't need that. So now I have the code that I want. And if all goes well, I will go ahead and pop it in here. Uh, clear and control shift V. I'm don't know how to zoom. Ah, oh, yes, okay, that should work. Uh, let's see, does control plus work? No. All right, so now I'm going to paste, control shift V to paste. And if all goes well, if my copy paste is good, I should be able to run this code. And it didn't. Uh, it didn't work. It just got the Docker version. So maybe I picked up some extra spaces in there. Uh, data name. Yeah, okay. So maybe this error here in the extra white space is causing the problem. No. So I've got something else uh, going on here. But in principle, it should have worked. Maybe you have better, better results, but uh, Google Lens now has more or less instant OCR. Thank you for watching and happy computing.